How's it going? This is Shane Thomas, ready to show you another country classic on the acoustic guitar. This time, this video, we are going to learn My Heroes Have Always Been Cowboys by Willie Nelson. A classic song by a classic artist. Very simple song. Won't take us too long. We just got about around four chords to learn. And uh, thank you to Ryan for requesting this song. I always appreciate the comments and the requests that I get from you all that watch these videos. So I really appreciate it. And let's get going. A little background on this song. It was written by Sharon Vaughn, a very prolific songwriter. It was interesting. Back in the, about the mid-90s, I visited Nashville for... I don't know how many times it was that trip, particular trip. It wasn't the first time. I know that. And I went to the Country Music Hall of Fame. Me and my buddy Tom Hatfield, my old running around partner, went to uh, stay the weekend in Nashville. And we went to the Country Music Hall of Fame, which one of the exhibits had this song's lyrics, handwritten lyrics. I think it was handwritten. It might have been on a typewriter with some handwritten notes around the lyrics. But the lyrics to this song from the songwriter was in a display, which was really cool to me. I thought that was really cool. Uh, it Waylon Jennings actually did this song in 1976, but the version I'm going to play is the Willie Nelson version uh, that hits the nylon string guitar. That's why I'm playing this for this particular video. And it was in the 1980 movie Electric Horseman. The Electric Horseman. I remember watching this on TV back we didn't have cable. So I used to watch those movies with commercials in them. And this with Robert Redford and uh, Willie Nelson. That's when I first learned this song. This song's in three, four time, which is like a waltz kind of. So that's your strumming pattern. Kind of sounds like, love me tender. Same kind of uh, rhythm, if you want to call that in the same key. But we're here to learn my heroes have always been cowboys. So first chord we're going to learn is the D chord. The D chord, D major chord, first string, second fret, put that middle finger there. On the third string, second fret, put your first finger there. And your ring finger goes on the second string, third fret, strum down, fourth string on down to make that D chord. But I would like for y'all to learn. Boom. Hit that A string, that fifth string open. When you play that D, I think that'll help you out. Boom. Help you with the rhythm. Boom. And that, you're going to be on that chord a lot. So, believe it or not, you, if you know this D chord and you know that little rhythm, you're going to have most of the song. Our next chord is G. G major chord. So you want to put a finger on the 6th string, 3rd fret. Put a finger on the 5th string, 2nd fret. Play the 2nd, 3rd, and 4th string open. And right there, that G note, put a finger on the 1st string, 3rd fret. So I think, again, a main component is getting this strumming pattern, that waltz kind of a, that kind of a rhythm. Because once you do it, we start singing. The intro is basically just D, pretty much. One thing that I love about this song, Willie, he doesn't really, he sings the song, but it's more like a speaking it like a spoken word kind of thing, or he's telling a story, uh, which is genius of Willie Nelson. He's just kind of whispering it, just kind of telling you a story. So let's start the story on the D chord. I grew up a dreaming, D, being a cowboy, to G, loving the cow. Boy, ways back to D. Stay on D. Pursuing the life of my high riding heroes. New chord. E7. Not a bad chord. Fairly easy chord to learn. Put your first finger on the 
third string first fret put your middle finger on the fifth string second fret strum all strings that's E7 Cern one more chord so we pretty much have the whole song A7 A7 second string second fret put a finger there then you skip the third string we play it open but don't press down on anything First, and then your fourth string, second fret, press down. I'll leave whatever fingers you want to use to play those strings. I'll leave it up to you. You can play the second and fourth finger, or your first and middle finger, whatever. As long as you press down the right strings on the right frets. Check out these chord diagrams so you can have a, have a guide and a reference if you need. And that's pretty much our whole chord. So let's start over with the verse and go through the complete chord progression. I grew up a dreaming of being a cowboy D to G, loving the cowboy ways. D, stay on D, pursuing the life. Of my high riding heroes, E7, I burned up my childhood days, A7, back to D, make this sequence again, learned all the rules of a modern day drifter, don't you hold on to nothing too long, back to D, G, just take what you need. To D from the ladies that leave them. D A7 D. And that's how you play the verses to this song. My heroes have always been cowboys. Now let's learn the chorus. Now that we learned the verse, the chords to the verses for my heroes have always been cowboys, let's learn the chorus. We already got all the chords that we need to know. We just got to put them in a little different order. Uh, now where we left off in the verses, sad country song, D. I like to lead it up with a D7. You don't have to, you can stay on the D to to G, my heroes have always been cowboys, but I like to lead it up from and put that D7 in there. D7, put your first finger on the second string, first fret, and then you put your middle finger on the third string, second fret, and then put your ring finger on the first string, second fret. I think you go when you go from D. I think it just gives a nice little lead up to the chorus. Now, how do you play the chorus? Very simple. We already know all the chords, so let's go back to G. My heroes have always been cowboys to D. E7, remember E7? They still are, it seems, A7. G, sadly in search of G to D, one step and back up, G, themselves, A7, slow moving dreams. So let's recap that. Chorus is G, I've always been cowboys, D, E7, A7, and we go back up to G. Sadly in search of D. One step and back of G. Themselves. A7. D. And you just stay on that D. And it goes into the second verse. Cowboy is a special. Stay on D, their own brand of misery. G, for being alone. 
too long. Love that line. Love that line. Mm -hmm. So D of a nightmare to E7. Knowing Wells' best days are gone. A7. Another great line right here. Picking up hookers. Instead of pin. Let the worlds of my youth. D and G. No way. A7. D. B7. Of course, again, my heroes have always been cowboys. E7. They still are, it's seen. A7. Back to G. Sadly, in search of. To D, one step and back of G, from cell to A7, dream. One more time, my heroes have always been cowboys, so G to D, E7, they still are, it seems, A7. Sadly, in search of G to D, G, D, A7, D. Sadly, in search of G, one step back of D to G, D, A7, D. And that's how you end the song. And that's how you play My Heroes Have Always Been Cowboys by Willie Nelson, written by Sharon Vaughn. A wonderful song, very easy to play, laid back. Great song for a campfire, just kind of chilling out, relaxing. Uh, very simple song, just got four chords, D, G, E7, and A7. If you want to throw the D7 in there, that'll make five chords. Just, I think, just want to remind you that the, the strumming pattern is very key to this song. Just a nice waltz kind of a strumming pattern. As long as you got that strumming pattern, you should be able to play this song, all right? Once you learn those chords and you'll have another country classic, that you can play for yourself and for your friends and family if you like. Speaking of if you like, if you like this video, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. If you want the latest guitar classics, guitar lessons, guitar tutorials as soon as I publish them. I want y'all to keep these songs alive by learning how to play them and give yourself a bunch of hours of enjoyment by playing them for, for hours on end. All right, if you like this video, hit that like button. You all take care, you all keep humming and strumming. I'm Shane Thomas. See you later.